On the morning of July 16th, 1969, three brave men aboard a Saturn V rocket began a journey into the heavens to complete the Apollo 11 mission of putting man on the moon for the very first time. This incredibly risky voyage took what had previously been considered impossible and made it a reality, as people across the globe tuned in to Neil Armstrong and Buzz Aldrin exploring parts of the lunar surface, while Michael Collins orbited above in the command module. The first ever manned moon landing is generally regarded as a moment that changed the world, becoming one of humankind's greatest achievements. After the success of Apollo 11, a further five manned missions to the moon were completed up until 1972, allowing 10 more astronauts to walk on the lunar surface. Thankfully, all of the brave astronauts returned back to Earth alive and safe, but it could well have been a very different story. According to the NASA scientists and engineers who helped make the Apollo 11 mission possible, the most dangerous aspect was actually launching from the surface of the moon. From computer malfunctions to complete engine failures, there could have been many devastating problems that may have prevented the astronauts from returning back to Earth. So what would have happened if something did go wrong? and the landing crew of Apollo 11 became stranded 238,855 miles away on our planet's desolate moon. If the astronauts had become stranded on the moon, then there would have been no way of bringing them back to Earth. NASA did not have any standby rockets or landers ready that may have been able to rescue the doomed crew. Instead, Mission Control would have allowed the astronauts to record a final statement for their families. They would have said their goodbyes and perhaps recommended how they should close their lives. It is said that NASA would have then ended all communications with the astronauts, granting them privacy in their final minutes or hours. The stranded men would have likely decided their next steps, maybe by the slow starvation of oxygen or potentially some kind of deliberate but faster option. Even now, the bodies of the astronauts would likely still be on the moon's surface, as it would be extremely difficult to collect and bring the brave men back to Earth for burial. President Nixon would have also apparently contacted each of the astronauts' widows-to-be, advising them of the situation and offering his condolences. Then he would have addressed the American nation, delivering a powerful eulogy that would have ended with the following sentences. In ancient days, men looked at the stars and saw their heroes in the constellations. In modern times, we do much the same, but our heroes are epic men of flesh and blood. Others will follow and surely find their way home. Man's search will not be denied, but these men were the first and they will remain the foremost in our hearts. For every human being who looks up at the moon in the nights to come will know that there is some corner of another world that is forever mankind. Meanwhile, Michael Collins orbiting above the doomed astronauts would have had to have made his way back to Earth alone, knowing that his crewmates are stuck on another world beyond rescue, never to return. Thankfully, none of the Apollo missions stranded an astronaut on the moon, but instead advanced mankind in science, engineering and exploration. So let's hope that a scenario like this never happens during our future missions to space and that we keep exploring new worlds successfully, bringing home the heroes that dared go where no other humans have been before. I really hope you enjoyed this video, remember to hit the like button and subscribe if you did. And why not check out some of my other videos, there's loads to choose from. Thank you so much for watching and I'll see you next time.